YouTube Tristars. Good afternoon, everyone. YouTube Tristars talking back to you guys again with another new review. And this review, this review is very special. This review is out of California. Um, this LED company is called JDM A Stars, and they are a new established company open in 2016 over there in california we're gonna give you more on this company in this review detail now that being said i went on the website and um on the website um doesn't really i couldn't um get the model of my truck on it but you can email or you can call customer service and they tell them the type of bulb you need and they will get it over to you as quickly as possible because they get me all the way from california to all the way in canada and it, it gets to me within um five to seven days business days i was on the road when it arrived but it, nevertheless it arrived i was thought it was gonna, gonna get there in two weeks and within a week i got a call that my package had um get to my house now i want to introduce to my viewers it's out of california weighing i don't know two ton uh, i'm just kidding for more videos like this please subscribe Bam! now this is a 6s and it is one of the rated led light this LED light JDM iStar is a fast growing online retailer that specializes in automotive LED technology. We offer a wide range of LED replacement bulbs and LED accessories for all types of vehicles like cars, trucks, SUVs, motorcycles, boats, RVs, and even lawnmowers. We carry the most up-to-date cutting-edge LED technology to stay one step ahead of our competition. Our goal is to provide you with the best quality LED replacement bulb, competitive pricing, and the best-in-class customer service. Here at JDM Asar, our number one priority is to provide you with the best customer service as well as customer satisfaction. But to do it better than anybody else, let JDM Asar be your premier choice to light your way on the road. Take the time out to see. In this video, I'm I'm gonna install my lights. Install my lights. Now, that being said, ladies and gentlemen, Tri Stars just wanna give a big shout out to JDM Stars and um, A Stars, and I wanted to say um, thank you guys for choosing my channel to do this review on your bulbs. Now, gonna give my honest opinion about these bulbs. You know what I mean? I am going to put these bulbs is the is the, the this time I got the whole entire package for my truck the I beam and I got the low beam light right here for my Volvo 2013 truck you know um the bul the bulbs are typically the same for all for all bul Volvo trucks you know what I mean um, I'm going to work with the headlights that these guys provide me and I'm I'm going to test it and it 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 when when I read the manual on these lights and these bulbs it says it can stand up to 80 degrees of heat and minus 40 in the cold but so the temperature of 80 in the in the heat and in the cold is 40 in Canada is one of the perfect place to test for the coldness how the, the bulb performed right um, before we get inside the box I'm so excited I read the comments leave on these bulbs i just want to let you guys know whenever i'm um, i come to you guys with a review on a product i personally take the time out to do some research myself i don't receive emails and you know go ahead and receive products and come along and be like you guys need to try this this is so good whatever no i am standing up for what work now in this video i'm, I'm going to install these bulbs along with the explanation about this company now there there are certain points there are certain things about this company that caught my attention based on what i've read you know what i mean so i want to go ahead and personally test this bulb for myself and also my viewers and also you guys i'm going to leave the link of the company the link of the website 
and all the contact information that you guys would need to purchase lights for your truck, cars, RVs, SUVs, commercial vehicle, off-road vehicle, and lawnmower. That one got me, got me off guard, lawnmower. Um, I, I didn't remember that lawnmower actually, we got the, the lawnmower that used the lights, you know. Yes, YouTube, so let's go inside the, the boxes, okay? So this is the G4, and this is the, the I-beam, right? I got these bulbs over on this side, just to let you guys know. This is the original, the OEM for the Volvo truck, which is the 9005, like, you know, 9005, the code. And um, on the I-beam, you can see where they mark it right there. So, I mean, the, whatever you, you desire or what you want for your vehicle, as you can look at the back there, there's everything stated on whatever bulb your you, your truck or car need you know what i mean so yeah um i'm using so i'm gonna use the replacement i got a lot of these bulbs up here i don't know if you guys can see but i buy it to stock in just in case i ever blow out on the road i i have spare bulb which when i got these leds i think no need to you know what i mean the life on these bulbs which I'm gonna get to shortly in the video. So let's go inside of the box to see what the bulbs are like. You know what I mean? We're gonna do this right here inside the truck. So let me get inside. Okay. Okay, YouTube. So inside the box we are. And the first thing we, we see is the, the, the product manual, right? Uh, we're gonna take a, a sneak peek. Well, at the back, it's, it's showing how to put the bulb in, where on, on the bulb to avoid your fingers, right? Now, just a quick peek. Okay. Now, inside the box, YouTube, inside the box, here comes the two I-beam bulb that we need for the headlight, right? Now, okay, so, as you can see, you can see the, the fan. You can actually touch the fan to cool the, the one that cooled down the bulb. Okay. This bulb is, the feeling of the bulb is strong, sturdy. You can see this is a steel or aluminum based on the, 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 the type. Um, at the edge, you can see, you can see they got uh, four LED custom made um, bulb um, chip inside on both sides and at the tip of the light you can see it's a chrome housing to match the inside of the headlight right so i mean it's it's pretty neat it's, it's strong and like i said the fan is at the back and the tag it said qc pass so you know in montreal in quebec there's a lot of rules with the DOT and this bulb pass Quebec laws, right? Now, everything is written there. Type the model, everything is under the tag, right? Now, like I said, Q QC pass. So the bulb is great, is, is rated to pass the DOT inspection in Montreal. You know that this is this is one of the, the province that have a lot of restriction on, on tires, light, wheels everything so this light can actually give you let you know you're yeah, ensure to not get in any trouble because of any light whatsoever so two of them come in the package and um like i said it it have this uh strong sturdy feeling to it and we're gonna see how these light perform so this is the look of the light youtube um I'm impressed. I like it. I like the color. I like the design. Um, the next thing for me to like is how it show on the road. So this is it, YouTube. Inside the box. Wow. So it's G4. Okay, so we're going to move on to the, the low beam lights. Now, here we go again now, YouTube. This is now the low beam lights. Our low beam LED bulb. It said 6S. And on it, on it, it says CSP chips. It says a 4,000 Loomis, and it's the CSP chips. 
right? So these strips are custom built. So let's go inside the package to see what it's like. And like, before I go there, now this is the, the low bean um, original bulb for the bulb for truck, right? And um, this is the H11. And on the box, you can see right here that this is the H11. So this is the low bean bulb. Like I said, I keep spare for because my bulb always, you know, blow, right? Now, this is inside the pocket. And now, this is like a different design. This one does not come with a fan. This come with a heat sink. Now, let's see what it's like. Now, this is, this is a, this is the first time I'm actually seeing a bulb like this. Very fancy. Very fancy. Like I said, JDM A stars. Um, it it got four chip on each side and four chip on the other side. This is the drive that it comes with. The um, input uh, voltage comes on the kit. And this is like a, a, a drive, right? For now. So these are what the bulbs look like, YouTube. And on this light, it's also QC Pass. That's for Quebec. Montreal. It's, it's tested and passed. So expect the best out of these bulbs that's what all those things are saying to me right now expect the belts the best out of these bulbs like i said four chip on either side and we are going to install these lights in our truck please stay tuned try stars trucking thanks for tuning in Now on this on this bulb, the G4, it's 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 put pushing out 8,000 lumis in these chip automotive customized chip. So it is the best of the best based on website and what I've read so far. So seeing is is believing. So we are going to install these chip in the truck. Yes, YouTube. Now, like I said, this is the, the I bean and over here is the low bean. What I didn't mention is that the heat sink can actually, it's flexible and it can actually move and fit in the, the position or the way how you um, need it to be fixed inside of the, the headlight. So I'm going to show you guys how it work and how it fit and now this is the the i beam bulb you know you can see on the back of it coming out of the volvo this is the nine zero the nine zero zero five and now uh, we're going to replace it with the led that is nine zero zero five and come stock Let me, let me try to fit it in the, in the slot first to see if it fits. Yes, it does. It does fit, it fit perfectly. You can see right at the back of the, at the, the light, you see where it sits in the, in, in the slot really nice. So I'm gonna put it back out just to 
test the light before I actually, you know, close it back. So I'm gonna turn the truck on just to test the light. Whoa, I can't, oh my God, YouTube, I can't even look at the light. It's so bright. My gosh, look at that. You can see the fan, the fan is spinning. You know what I mean? And as, as the thing has told us, we should not touch this. So I'm not gonna put my hand there, but yeah, look at, look at that. Okay, all right, it's working. So you guys already know, I uh, so tried a uh, LED bulb in my um, low bean um, maybe a couple months ago. Um, I'm going to take those out and try my new and improved JDM A-Star light in my LED. So I'm going to take those one out and put it in, in, the, in the, the, and try it in my fog light or something. And um, let's see how JDM, what it does to my headlight. Okay, so this is the the ones I had in. So I'm gonna replace it with the new lights. Okay, so these 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 um heat sink can actually, like I said, they can they can um go to where you you you, you want them to be, just just to fit inside the the, the slot. And the heat, it's no fan, but the heat will play along on these so what i'm going to do i'm going to try it inside there to see if it fits and then we, we test the light to see if it actually work with the switch before we actually see what's going on through those headlights so here we go okay so it's not going to work like this so i'm going to put the heat sink forward i'm going to put the heat sink forward we test it back from this so we're gonna try it like this inside okay it, it fits you can actually see but um there it is it fit perfectly in the slot um you can see the heat sink um set sideways but we can also um put it back out let's see how it works now in there and it's on but look, look at the ground. Look at the pattern at the ground where, where, where the light cut off. You know what I mean? You can see the pattern on the ground where it's like, you can see where the light is here and up here it's dull. Like the, the pattern is just a slant away for. We're gonna put it back up and then we're, we're gonna look at the lights, compare the, the, the two lights. This side is the LED and this side is the original lights that's in the truck. So LED, original. Let's go closer. This is the original and the LED. Yes, YouTube, this is the other side. I'm testing the, the, the bulb before I actually put it in. That's the slot. The fan is on the back blowing. Now, YouTube, this is very impressive. Look at the light pattern on the ground. Look at the light pattern on the ground. You can see where the, the, the dim is cutting away from the rear view mirrors, or I can say from the windscreen of incoming driver and ongoing driver. Like, Drivers in front of you, you're not gonna blind them when your low beam is on. And driver coming towards you, you're not gonna blind them. Look at the pattern, YouTube. This is no joke right here. No, this is what I'm talking about. Cause you know, the wood is turned down to the ground. And look at the pattern. From the 
We look at the pattern. JDM. This is a good look so far. Until we go out on the road to test it. Now, by just installing the light, I'm like I'm liking the pattern I've seen on the ground. That's a good look, JDM. Good one. Very good one. Yes, YouTube. Um, the covering went back on perfect with the heat sink that long and everything. It fit perfectly inside the housing. You know what I mean? Um, same thing for the for the I beam. So we have no problem on either side. For more videos like this, please subscribe. <laughs>